three games on the baseball card Thursday night, but I've got a free play for you in one of them. Nationals Phillies, a free play on the total coming up for you in this video in just a moment. Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV. And we're breaking down one of your three nighttime games here on Thursday at 6.40 Eastern, Washington at Philadelphia. And I like the over eight in this game, but more specifically, I think the Phillies team total over four and a half is probably the best way to play it. So once again, if you have access to team totals, I like the Phillies over four and a half team total the best. If not, I would still lean over eight in this game between the Nats and Phillies. As I do think both offenses can put up some runs, but more specifically, I think the Phillies can put up some runs because they have a much better pitcher on the mound. And Zach Wheeler, 2.9 ERA in his last seven starts, 2.80 ERA overall this year. So I'm a little concerned the Nationals might struggle to do their part and get over the two and a half. So instead of the full game over eight, I think the Phillies over four and a half is the best play in this game, especially against Mitchell Parker for the Nats who has a solid 3.8 ERA in the season, but it looks like he's wearing down, as young pitchers often do later in the season, with a 5.0 ERA in his last seven starts. And that's despite back-to-back -back shutouts against the Brewers and Angels. 12 innings, no runs allowed. He is due to regress. In fact, I'd use several pitch regression models that show a regression is due tonight, especially against the Phillies, who are also due to start putting up some runs. And I think maybe we saw that breakout last night when they put up nine runs at home against Miami. Now, keep in mind, they were coming home off an extended road trip, had Monday off, and they were flat Tuesday. That's often what happens. Teams get home. They have that day off, distractions of being back home, routines that you got to get back into, family shopping, everything else you got to do. And it showed on Tuesday night when they got shut out against the Marlins. But I think the wake-up call was the nine-run performance last night on Wednesday. We'll look for that momentum to continue Phillies over four and a half total runs. A nice team total play for you tonight at 640 Eastern on Thursday. Hey, don't forget, if you want my strongest baseball best bets, I've got two strong best bets for Thursday on my page right now at wagertalk.com. Check that out right now, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Now you can get the two-pack for Thursday or you get the plays individually, or the best deal is buy three days, get seven days, all sports. That includes baseball and also any NFL preseason I had this week. It's seven days for the price of three. A single play is $25 for just one play on one day. A one-day package is $39. A three-day package is $69, and you're getting seven days now for the price of three. That's right, seven days for just $69. That's less than $10 a day. $69, dude. Check it out right now. No promo code needed. Seven days for the price of three. This week only. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. You can also follow me on X on Twitter at Steve Merrill. Two R's, one L, at Steve Merrill on X on Twitter. And don't forget to comment below. I read all the comments. What are your thoughts on the three games tonight on Thursday? Where do you see some value in Major League Baseball? Be sure to comment below. I read the comments and reply back. Thumbs up, like if you're finding these free play videos useful. And don't forget, click subscribe and consider hitting the bell as well for instant alerts so you never miss these free play videos or shows when they go live here on Wager Talk TV. And stay tuned here to Wager Talk TV for some more great free content coming up next.